Well, guys, we're, believe it or not, back. <laughs> Another two-hour episode. Uh, somehow I was able to manage to get crashed in the house. She doesn't get tired. She already was starting to bring me stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's the rest of the afternoon. So I, I think we want to think of organic puppy training as we're not luring it. We're not, we're just pointing out things that we like. You're not, I, just, I don't like luring. I just don't think it, I don't think it has a, I don't hear it in a positive way. Oh, dear lure and all these things. Go to the feed store, dear lure. Lure them to their death. All right, let me get their toys. Oh, that one's going to pick up that rope. Maybe it almost did. Almost don't pick it up. Oh, my God, it's probably going to be a bad storm. All right, I'm going to see if I can just look at this rope and it'll pick it up. I think they might end up going and getting it. Yeah, gloss and go. How's Mishka? How's Jackson? How's Dick? I know you've got your hands full with those three. That he's like, I got this. All right, so, yeah, you've got to have that as part of your strategy. You've got to say to yourself, this dog is going to have various strategies. I need to have various strategies, too. And, and we do. We have strategies in life all the time. All right, don't go on the interstate, take the toll road. You know what I mean? You're just, you're in a constant, maybe trying to find the path of least resistance. And they're definitely trying to do that. So I've got my little tennis shoe. I've got my glasses case. I should probably... Oh, I guess I can't put the glasses in there. The glasses. I've got the one little flute, which was the original thing, and the dumbbell. And remember, I was putting them in the wagon, so let me try putting it in there. Oh, she, oh like she didn't see. Oh, she already saw it in there. And this was the one, remember, that was going in the side. Or she was jumping up over that way to get in there. Oh, he'll dive right in. You little monkey. Oops, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, let me see. I can put it somewhere else. Rewarding naturally occurring behaviors. You're not telling them to do anything. No, they're ready, though. Now see if he comes out of there and gives them to me. That'll be really good. <laughs> Uh-oh. Got to pick them up, though. I'll tell you what's, what I'm using today and what, is, what isn't good about it. What's good about it is they really like it. What's bad about it is it's that natural balance roll, and it kind of crumbles. And you see you get all these crumbs on the ground, so you have to be careful. You have to try to cut it exactly the right size. All right, so she's got the optimum position being up there. Put it over here for her. Uh oh. I'm gonna have to do better than that now. Oh, now she's gonna have to bring it to me. I think 
that's your, you know, I think that's your trajectory. You're getting them picking it up, and then you're trying to see if you can get them to travel with it. You know, you're trying to see if you can get them to travel with it. And I think you need to condition them to travel anyway. You know, you're conditioning them to travel separately anyway. You little fast as the wind. Oh, 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 my goodness. Anyway, I named this one Queso. Because he looks like my old Queso. I have a puppy Queso. He was a singleton. Oh, how I loved that puppy. He was a very special puppy. Anytime there's a singleton. People think a singleton is bad. I think a singleton is fantastic. This is a total clean slate. All right, so I'll put two things in there so they can each get one. Ah. Hang on, mommy doesn't have a treat ready. I think that's the point you're going for. They're traveling. All right, so now I'm just looking in there. They can't really see it. Oh, no, they can't. She's going to boost herself into there. Watch. You little smarty. She's like, where's mine? And if you said, why does she do that? That's what she did. She was successful doing that. I think that's what we have to think of, too. The reason she keeps attempting... And that isn't the path of least resistance, but it's the only path she knows. It's the path to success. So maybe they think of that as the path of least resistance. But because she was successful the first time, she believes she can be successful again. All right, let me see if I can get them to pick. And we're going to go out in the field a minute. They may be able to find that pen light and that phone. I wouldn't be surprised. I like the little basket though, just because it's it's easy to get a hold of. Some of this stuff is harder to get a hold of. All right, watch. See? And she was successful. I'm telling. If you said, what did she say to herself? Get a running start. All right, so I can put it a little farther away. All right, look. They don't see it there. I'm just gonna go by the look. Why did they look up? They're hunting the old fault. Yeah, he spotted it. So I'm obviously looking this way now. That was a coincidence, Charles. <laughs> now he's trying the old way to get in there. Yeah, he's a huge talent. I hope you're watching this, Courtney. I'm going to get all this written down, edit all this footage together into a... faster than, I understand that. It's got to be faster than instant. It's got to be simultaneous. You said what's faster than instant? Simultaneous. What's faster than that? The food's the precursor. Alright, so I'm going to put this behind my back. Send him fool that one. 
That didn't fool that one. This one's watching so close. Yeah, she he by she's playing second string to his uh, first string. And you do want to reward him just for finding you interesting. All right, guys, we're going to go down to the pond before it gets to... Uh, are you loving that, Chelsea? Huh? That's what you need to get, Jelly. You need to get this little tiny shoe. Yeah, just get one of Jackson's old shoes. Old glasses. All right, I'm going to try the... And they're pretty good now about if something drops. They're he, this, especially this little yellow one will default to picking it up. Oh, she got it first. Oh, you both get some. All right, so it'll be a little more complex. I'll come over here, I'll put it in the way. All right, he might bring it out. I hope you saw that, Chelsea. That's all we're going to need. This, you're going to need to start getting the uh, list together. They're going to have to have one of these step two wagons. Chelsea's like, what? <laughs> yeah. Step two wagon, that tiny tennis shoe, uh, the ruined pair of Oakleys. She's always going to try that route. He... He had success with going in the door initially, so, you precious angel. All right, what I'm gonna do is try putting it back farther in the corner and then he will have to come out and bring it to me. Not necessarily, I think he will though. Yay! <sighs> Need a whole collection of rock and roll hoodies to start with. Okay, I already got those. Chelsea's like, I got those. I live in Canada, lady. We wear hoodies in August, just like you. I'm going to tell you, he now sees her doing that and knows that there's something in there. Yeah, she got it. All right, so I put it back in there quietly. Now I'm just looking. I'm gonna scoot over a little farther. <laughs> I was going, but he looks so cute giving it to me. All right, so I'm gonna try putting it a little bit farther and see if he'll come out. I mean, it's hard, it's hard to deny that the dog is giving it to me. I want to get a puppy. I know, how cute. It's definitely. Oh, yeah, Melissa, I'm sorry. Woman, I didn't know it was going to require all these wagons, this, that, and the other stuff. You're the one that, that's what we always default back to. And then, and then I have my little, we got to say, this guy's smart. He found me. <laughs> and then yours is, oh, you're the one that found her. How did I know we were going to need all this wagon and all this hoodies and all this stuff? <laughs> It's funny though, because he's got, he's got the, he seems to understand too. He's got the two delivery methods from in there, the go through the door or the go over there. Well, he didn't necessarily see it go over there. I'm going to just look. He doesn't know where it was. She's looking at me. You better bring it to mama. Yeah, this job is as fun as it looks. I'll be honest with you, it's crazy. Ah, be careful, Bug. All right, Bug's got to get her love time. So if I said Bug's going to be a therapy time. Bug, Bug just, oh look, that one might go get the rope. Remember how I said they might go get it. I'm not, I wouldn't be surprised if that little, she thought about it. If I went and put it in here, she would definitely. She's looking for something to get, so is he. He's 
definitely bringing it to me. And Chelsea, I do think it is, if you remember when I very first started doing it, I put that bend back towards the handler and that's what's there. No alternative choice has presented itself until, it, not that it might not, not that it might not. But it's, at this time, no alternative choice has presented itself. Jim and Phyllis used to tell me, and this was years ago, and I remember at that I was always in awe of them and always wanted to be as good as them. But they would do trained retrieves on three-month-old puppies. In my mind at that time, I was like, you know, that's what they routinely did, though. That was three months old, and they, they did a trained retrieve. And I'm sure they were bird dogs. You wouldn't be doing it really on anything but bird dogs, but... That's what they did. I have to, Maybe I remember right. I don't think I do. I think I remember right. All right, so I'm going to put it in that back corner. Oh, she's figuring it out, too. He didn't see it over there. She got lucky. You little monkey. Yeah, so that's what you're going to need, Melissa. You're going to need this wagon. You're going to need various plastic platforms from industrial parks around the state. <laughs> uh... You can see, you've already got the climb, and I do like the climb because it is multi-purpose. You can put the dog on there, and you can sit on it and easily be the seated handler without, you know, if it was a chair, you've got arms, and a chair, honestly, your average chair is higher than this. <laughs> you know, unless it's a kid's chair. All right, so watch. tries that way though and he knows he knows he's got time <laughs> he knows he's got time to go around there I think it's very very important to understand how easily things can get imprinted in them you know and so that if it's we may know where to look yeah we've got to have this in fact you know what Melissa you know where I get this stuff this is where you need to look girl I think you already said you have Amazon Prime um, is Amazon warehouse deals. I think there's a way to save the search. But if you go Amazon warehouse deals, uh, step two or little tyke stuff, this it's cheap. That little red wagon was 20 bucks. That was with free shipping. Look at that little cutie. Uh, that big wagon, I think it was like 38 bucks or something. All right, guys, come on. Let's just go on a little, let's just go on And I think they might be able to find this. Who goes for a walk when it's getting ready to pour down? Me? Okay. All right, so I don't have my...